what disables you from work, from being productive, from being successful, from being from being a contributing part of society as a parent, as a kid, as a boss, as an employee, as a business owner. The number one thing that is keeping people disabled from their potential and their ability is depression. Listen, some people have a chemical imbalance and there are treatments for that. And I endorse the medical treatments for diseases that are of the brain. But we can change our brains and we can impact our brains with the word of God because Jesus is our healer and either he really heals or he doesn't. And if he really heals and he's the same yesterday, today and forever, which he is, he does and he is, then we can believe that he can heal us of mental illness too. He can heal us of depression. He can heal us of anxiety. But here's his number one method of healing us from anxiety and depression. And that is perspective, focusing on what we have, what we have, what we have, what we have. What was the first commandment? Look, Adam and Eve, eat freely from all these trees. The first commandment was to focus on what they had. And the curse of unhappiness and the curse of sin and the curse of bondage and the curse of being separated from God, all of that came because Adam and Eve focused on what they didn't have rather than what they did have today, today. Don't wait for tomorrow. Don't wait till next month. Don't wait till the next paycheck. Don't wait for the next bonus, the next increase, the next good thing that comes into your life. Stop right now and today start focusing on what God has given you. Start focusing on what you have, what you have, what you have, what you have, what you have. You You will become thankful, which creates happiness. Gratitude is the parent of happiness. Gratitude is the parent. Happiness is the child. Gratitude is the parent that gives birth to the child. Thankful, thankful. thank, Thank you, Jesus, for breath, life. Thank you for my family, thank you for the word. Thank you for the promises. Thank you for the Holy Spirit. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for healing me. Thank you for saving me. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. You didn't reject me. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. You didn't send me to hell. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. You sent somebody across my path. Thank you for sending that other person across my path. Thank you for buying me some time, Lord. Thank you for being patient with me. Thank you for not judging me. Thank you for not condemning me. Thank you for loving me. Thank you for your grace. Thank you for your goodness. Thank you for your kindness. Thank you the goodness and mercy. Oh, I'm starting to make myself happy because gratitude is the parent of happiness. It's time for all of us to become parents. It's time for all of us to have some kids and the kids you need to give birth to is happiness.